The first way I organize headbands and accessories is with this headband holder. This headband holder also has storage inside for hair clips and hair bands. The second way I organize hair accessories is with this craft storage case. I use it to store hair bands and as you can see I have them labeled. The great thing about this is I know what I'm running out of. So as you can see I'm out of red and orange but there's also this nice long side compartment where I can put longer clips and accessories. My third idea is this hair accessory display. To start, I'm going to use this frame that I found at the thrift store and I'm going to dry brush paint it to match this jewelry holder that I had made previously so that they can hang on the wall next to each other. Carefully remove all the staples before you take out the picture inside and discard it. Remove any dust by wiping it down, but make sure you let it dry before you start painting. If you've never dry brushed before, you definitely want to have a paper towel or some newspaper handy so you can wipe off your brush and then very gently wipe it on your frame to see how much paint is coming out and just be gentle with it and patient. Go very light and then you can always make it darker as you go along. For this project, I chose to do three long ribbons vertically and I'm going to measure all around and mark my entire frame so that they're even from top to bottom. I may not use all these marks exactly, but I want to use them to make sure that all my lines are even. Pull each ribbon as tight as possible before gluing. You want it to be taut. If you're using a patterned ribbon, make sure it's facing the front of the frame.
To hang headbands, I'm going to use those scraps to make loops around the frame. I decided on this stretchy black velvet to finish off my project, so I'm going to carefully glue it around the edges a little at a time, pulling it as tight as possible to make sure it's flat underneath. And that's it! Now your hair accessories are ready to be displayed.